So because of the way that WP Engine is built, they've got these um, sites that have subdomains, ethansite2.wpengine.com, and you cannot rename that. Uh, so what you have to do is you actually have to clone it. Um, so you copy from existing, we're gonna choose Ethan Site 2 and we're gonna rename it in this new uh, site that we created. So what I wanna make sure of is I wanna create a backup point to make sure we have the most recent backup. So I'm gonna name this backup from, for transfer. Create production backup. And then we're gonna wait for a second. And what you're gonna have to do is hit refresh um, a couple of times. I paused it so you wouldn't have to wait here, but you'll hit refresh. And once it appears right here at the first line, then it's good to go. It's usually pretty quick. Um, I wanted to save you the time. So I have to come over here again. I'm gonna hit re refresh. So once you create a site, um, then it's gonna have these installs. So you're gonna copy from existing. We're gonna choose Ethan site two because that's the one that's live. And the backup point is the backup for transfer that we just created. This is gonna be advanced P PCKG. And so that's available. Um, usually this is the only issue I have is this issue right here, but it's good. We're choosing Ethan site two, the most recent back up and we're going to hit create and that's going to create an install uh, with advanced pckg with all the information and the database from this website so when this goes away when this gold strip goes away um, then you can go to advanced pkg or pckg.wpengine.com and it'll be the same site as what's here because it's copying over so i just wanted to show you how to do that